All you photographers out there who've been wanting to get into the wonderful world of film emulation, I've got some good news for you. The Dehancer plugin is now available for various photo editing softwares. I'm gonna be checking it out today in Adobe Lightroom. It's available for Lightroom and Photoshop, also Capture One and Affinity. I think that's the name of it. Regardless of which one you buy, the plugin itself, I think basically works the same. It looks the same. I'm gonna show you Lightroom just cause that's the application that I know the best. I'm not really a photo editor. Photoshop is like calculus to me. I've never been able to figure out how that program works. But anyway, it'll it'll work the same regardless of, of how you use it. If you do get the Photoshop and Lightroom version, you get the plugin for both of those. You can install it in both applications at the same time and use it interchangeably if that's the way you go. It has all the same film emulations, the film looks that, that are in the full version of for Resolve. And it has all of the same effects, except for the two that are like motion picture. It's required that you have a moving image for it, and that would be the gate weave and the film breath, but everything else is in there. If you wanna check out the answer, you can use my promo code. It is dazed and confused. You'll get 10% off whether you wanna get the photo version or the full version for DaVinci Resolve or any of the individual effects. I'll get a 10% commission, you'll get 10% off. A friend of mine, a guy that I've worked with a couple times in the past, he takes a lot of uh, photos with film cameras. So I reached out to him a couple months ago, asking him if he would let me use some of his photos. We could just basically take a look at as reference. And, and what if we do this instead? <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to make this video actually entertaining slightly. I'm gonna show you photos that were edited with the Dehancer plugin. So these will be from the Panasonic Lumix G9 and then I'll show you a picture that was shot on film. I will let you decide or choose which you think is film and which you think is digital. And at the end of the video, I will reveal the answer. So jump down in the comments and feel free to put your guesses in there and see if you were right. lent me his photos. His name is Carter. He's got a YouTube channel. He hasn't posted a lot of stuff, but he's a super creative and quirky dude. I'll put a link to his YouTube channel and also his Instagram and uh, you can check him out there. Were you able to guess right? Do you think that the Dehancer emulation is convincing or is it obvious which one's digital and which one is film? I really like Dehancer. I've loved using it for the past, I don't know, year and a half, I guess, with Resolve. I like having the ability to do the same kind of effects and emulations with my silly thumbnail and my pet pictures that go on Instagram. <laughs> I really like Dehancer. I just wanted to show you this plugin and let me know what you think. Really appreciate watching the video and maybe I'll see you another time or another place in time. See ya, bye.